Okay, so every year I would get invited to Susie's Halloween party. And every year I would think and think about my Halloween costume. Believing as I did because my mother told me it was so, that there was nothing more important or valuable than originality and creativity. So the first year I went to this party, after a great deal of thought, I decided to go as the Little Match Girl. Which doesn't sound all that original, I know, but, but I decided to do it authentic. So um, I found some nasty clothes in the basement somewhere, and, and, and I ratted my hair real bad, and it, there was dirt. Like, I rubbed dirt all over myself. And the result was, I have to say, excellent. And I could not wait to get to this party and, and, and walk in and, and be like, this is it, girls. This is what real creativity looks like. And I get to the party and I walk in and all the other little girls, everyone was dressed as a beautiful princess. And I thought, okay, this isn't going to work out the way I pictured it. You're all princesses, and I'm clever, sort of, but not really because I'm covered in dirt. So we, um, we spent the rest of the day playing this game called Fairies, which is a game in which you run around the perimeter of the yard uh, pretending to be a fairy. And the fun, the fun of this game is well, if you happen to be dressed as a beautiful princess, it, that you feel your pretty hair blowing in the breeze and you feel your pretty dress fluttering behind you and you feel really pretty, that's the point. I played along because what else was I going to do? I had chosen ugliness. For some odd reason, I can't remember anymore, I had actually chosen ugliness, and now I had to clop around in it, surrounded by fluttering beauties. <laughs> oh, God, I remember thinking, and not for the first time, adulthood must surely be better than this. I vowed that next year I would also be a beautiful princess. 